As after Kogan's footsteps could no longer be heard, Ladua turned to face you. Not a word of this to anyone. If they should find out otherwise, think yourself as dead. Ladua turned to sharp eyes on you as if to warn you again. Taking the Queen's hand, he cast a transferring spell. And back to town. Left alone, feeling rather strange. Satisfied that you would help the Queen, yet suspicious of her. See, the Queen upset is nothing out of the ordinary, but her heart seems to be lacking something deep. Watching a doll that is trying to act human. I'm thinking too much. The place seems to be playing with my mind. Don't you think the Queen's acting funny? All she does is repeat the same thing over and over. It's really creepy. Then there's Colgan who seems to hate you intensely. They're hiding something, I know it. Let's start this over for the let's play. So we are back. When we last left off, I took on a new party member, Hina. It's not that Ricardo permanently died, it's that we brought her on the party for her quest to help my brother. So we need to reach a particular point in the dungeon with her and the party to complete that quest. So I am bringing her with us. Uh, it's not like 100, like, I'm not getting a ton of XP or a uh, stone for, for completing it, but it is necessary to complete some of the side quest stuff. Um, in the sense that there's some side quests you have to unlock by completing all the other side quests. Doing so in the process also upped my um, party relationship meter like almost to max. Uh, so actually, something I did not do last time um, is I did not go to... Or is it the guild to see if there are any new um any more you know, moves I've I've unlocked for purchase. Uh other thing that happened last time, we rescued the queen queen from the really nasty well from from the guy who kidnapped her and had her in the possession of a demon in some variety. However, she is acting weird. Aha! Yep, got a new one. Sweep spell. That is worth the money. Basically, just ups the range of the cast of spell. Good. That is actually very useful for for dealing with the spiders in one of the dungeons that we we'll have to deal with. Uh, all right. Deploy. Only one they have unlocked there. Not very effective. Press cross. For an enemy thrown in the air while it is vulnerable. Huh. That's a giant pile of cash for that spell, for that ability, but it's probably worth it. I, I would hope so. The deploy ability to avoid um, AoE attacks has not turned out to have not actually been that useful. Um, it basically served to increase the animation time for winning, for taking damage from AoE attacks. Um, hopefully this one will work better than what I've, the one I've currently got for my everybody in the front row gangs up on one dude ability, which is, um, Converge Attack. We'll see if Criss Cross is more effective. Um, anyway... Back at the labyrinth. Now, before we actually return to where we were at, I'm gonna stick. I want to swing by the royal chambers to see if there's any new dialogue that comes up if we go in. Also, have a kitty. Um, I'm gonna do a transfer potions. I could do with another one for Kalo and Creo.
Okay. And a bunch of decisions I decided to actually start picking up some of this stuff from the lower level guys because it's still useful for, you know, spell crafting. I'll go left a couple sessions ago, so. Not swinging by there. since the broken sword item is really useful for crafting offensive spells for the main spellcaster who hasn't maxed out his um uh, Creo hasn't maxed out their offensive spellcasting ability yet ah I hadn't noticed that bit before and to go back to town so there's a WBSW that's missing or worn away take transferring potion it will take you back instantly the mighty warrior Odom me, sir. I'm holding off on doing the, um, if you've come here by, from the Twitch channel, or the Twitch channel from, okay, oh, yeah, dialogue. A well-groomed knight stood in front of the door. He approached you in order to talk, possibly remembering you from the past. Currently, nobody is in the room. Ladua has taken Her Majesty to a safer place. Her Majesty was unwilling at first, but, uh, because of her strong sense of responsibility for Duhan. She was eventually convinced that both of them, Though both of them are not here, the labyrinth is still under her rule. Therefore, please continue your search. Okay, that's what I wanted to know. If there was any new dialogue there, the answer is no. The queen is somewhere else. We don't know where somewhere else is. We just know that she's there. Save time. All right. So B6, during my explorations last time, turns out has a chunk where the auto map don't work. Spiders. So now you try the new spell out action. Front guard did that block poison attacks. Or poison the poison status. Okay, so there was enough damage to actually kill them all. Um probably just slip probably because they picked the wrong level spell.
good news is, not that much damage, and the spe spell appeared to be working okay. I'm gonna start with cold instead. Much better. Plus, you've used that the first time. Oh god, I've got a better way to deal with the spider enemies. The one minus of this is I have a spell that's that same level that is a, uh... That also attacks all enemies. So we can probably use it for like the low level um, lightning attack spell. More spiders. Ah, oh, good. Friendly spiders. And first set of traps for this. One character leveled up. I actually probably use my max level teal on the spiders to save some of the higher level stuff as well. Try that next time. I think I sold the Wormwood's eyeball to the shop to the uh, monster material shop already.
Ah, new dialogue spot. In the nauseating air, the stench of blood filled your nose. Appeared out of the mist were two poison giants, the strongest of all giants, who predicted the ending of this tragedy. Our beloved queen is really naught but a soulless shell, called a homunculus, a living being that God himself forbade from being. Sir Eugene Gistam, for the man who would use monsters to kidnap the queen. I realized it by watching Incubus' response. Oh, he quite enjoyed it. For me, it was, it was just a waste of my oh-so-precious time. The queen's heart was like an empty spring, devoid of emotion. We are all fools, deceived by Ledua's little doll. Eugene stopped speaking. speaking. He seemed to be in deep thought. If we are to believe she is a fake, then everything else makes sense. A soulless being can't stir the grieving hearts of the people. So, where is the real queen? Did she die in the flash, or was she taken somewhere? I must find out the truth. But for that, it matters not how much I must sell my soul. For I will do it until I can endure it no longer. But the rumor was true. Owen's voice echoed clearly in the labyrinth. Eugene, you... Did you really make a car contract with the King of Darkness to take over Duhan? And what if I did? That, that... Do you think that God will forgive you? Open your eyes, it's still not too late. Before you are doomed to hell for all eternity. Those who love peace will be the ones who receive God's blessing. Your parents were religious, so you knew that too. So why... Grace's voice was help, trembling and helpless, as if it would vanish at any moment. You have the courage to stain your hands, and there is nothing you can do. God will never forgive your evil acts. I am no longer fearful of such trivial things as death and destruction. I have become a level 5 edge lord. I have but one path. Gain the crown, or die trying. Once one starts evil, it must it must be followed through until the end. I'm going to keep digging until I re reach the Earth's core or China, whichever comes first. If that's the case, if if that's the case, then let me come with you. No, don't go with him. Two people are far stronger than just one, but it's not just two people. It's him and a whole bunch of really nasty monsters that he's gotten to serve his cause. Don't concern yourself with me anymore. It is in your best interest to go back to town and find a new life. Go home and be a family person. Do you really mean that? I will rule Duhan. Until the day comes, there is nothing else meaningful here. And if I could stop, it makes no difference. My body and soul are no longer my own. Yalthotep has gotten inside my brain and is driving it like a car. E Eugene! Grace was upset. I never knew my brother was that edge. that got that edge lord. Her lips tightened and her arms shook. My cat is trying to investigate the sound bar. I hate. I hate the Flash. It's the worst of the CW. Of, of, of the CW superhero shows. No one persuade me otherwise. He destroyed not just the town, but people's hearts as well. He's not the same gentle, pious man I remember. He'll never return until the dark fires of ambition are extinguished. I don't know what code fire extinguisher I need to use to, do, to put it out. I'm going back to town. I can't stop him anymore. So if what Sir Eugene is true, then we've been deceived the whole time. Why would Sleeve do a, do a, a foolish thing as that, though? We punish quickly once he is exposed. On top of that, people were getting suspicious of the Queen's behavior. 
Was the dude just planning to keep up the act? I know... I think I know what Ledua is thinking. The real queen is alive somewhere. Using adventurers to find her, right? That's why the labyrinth hasn't been shut down and we are encouraged to explore it. Of course, this is, this is only if Sir Eugene's story is true. Other than that, I don't know what he has done. The chief of the queen's guard revised in forbidden arts. There must be a reason. You know it's not always easy to see the truth. In this case, though, the truth seems to be surrounded by darkness. Those who are touched by it are not safe. You know I get a really bad feeling that this labyrinth is filled with that darkness. Okay, let's go. Yeah, I'm not gonna like you're there. I'm not gonna turn around and let you hit me in the back. That seems that would lead, get, lead to me getting sneak attacked. Okay. That's Durgan's leveled up as well. Okie dokie. Let's keep exploring, though. Alright, so this is the part where I need to double check the map. So I can get through this a little more efficiently. Spiders and zombies. Actually, no, I'm not going to use the sweet spell here. Um, I'm going to use front guard. Dispel the zombies. Attack the zombies if the spell doesn't work. Actually, not. I'm telling you. Um, the assisted spell. Make sure we get them all. and then dispel on the rotting corpses. Okay. 
Let's finish mapping this room. door out. Uh, okay, now I actually have monsters entering the room. Okay. Okay. Well, then let's do an experiment. You do conferred attack on you. Alright, that's 120. Okay, so that is actually more damage with the Converge attack on these guys. Oh, right, you're immune to magic. Oh, forgot about that. Okay, so I guess I want to do a Brick Shot. And then third attack on you. Bunch of thieves and two spellcasters. What is his? Uh, we get to surprise attack them. Alright. So, uh, I want to have you do a sweep spell with the heal. got for uh, pickups this time. Uh, Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. I also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any f future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that.